Welcome back everybody, MTG Singles here. What we're going to do today is a little something different. We got ourselves a bundle from Ravnica Allegiance. And then just randomly we have one pack of War of the Spark I found sitting around that wasn't in a box. And I'm like, hmm, let's open that too. So here we go. This was brand new sealed. I went ahead and just opened it, uh, took off the, the wrapping right before the uh, video just to save some time. That should be empty, and I believe yeah, we have our dice, or die, right there. I'll put that with my little set. We've got 10 booster packs. And a direction card. And then this pack right here is um, usually just a bunch of commons and then like some foil lands and regular lands. Uh, so it's just kind of like the, uh, the the 2020 one as well. So we're not going to really focus too much on that. We'll put that back as with this little anti-theft device there. Throw that away. And let's go ahead and see. So this uh, the, um, set has a... Um, Sorry, uh, this uh, little bundle was about 45 bucks or so. So that's all we have to get back out of this. But, you know, most of you know this set doesn't have, you know, too much value uh, in it. You know, you can get a couple good rares or mythics. Um, really only one good mythic non-foil. Uh, just a hydroid casus. There's a couple other ones that are, you know, around five, six bucks. But then the rares, like Breeding Pool, Guileless Shine, Blood Crypt, Stomping Ground, Hollow Fountain. All lands, of course, mostly. So let's go ahead and see what we got. So we're going to skip right past the commons. And really going to skip back to the uncommons, too, unless they're a foil. Oh. <laughs> and look at that. First pack, we got the most expensive card in the set. Um, Non-foil, anyways. The Hydroid case, uh, Crass Crassus. Sorry. Oh, how about that? And then we do have... No foil common behind it. So look, that's a uh, half the value of the uh, little booster pack already. Not a bad little start. About twenty-two bucks. So if we're going to title this, you know, should you buy them? I don't know. I mean, obviously they're not uh, skimping out on putting good cards in these kind of sets. And a priest of the forgotten. Uh, gods, uh, so that is not a hit. Oh, let me see here. We'll put our commons or our foils up there, and like that. So we're doing pretty good with the first card or with the first pack. Just need one or two more good packs now, and then uh, this will have been a winner. The bedecked and the bedazzle. That's always been an interesting one. Oh, and a foil rare. Mikia and the Old Ways. Um, so I actually don't know. The, the non-rare version of this one is uh, not a hit. But you never know. The, uh, rare, uh, the foil versions of some of these can be worth a little something. So we'll figure out the price of that. I might even uh, pause the video later on and come back and tell you. I mean, I'll put the prices there too, but I like to comment on what value we got back. So... We did get a foil rare. I don't know if you get a foil rare every bundle. I couldn't tell you. Hope everybody's doing good today. Roll the dice right there. A Bithink Biomancer. And a Macro Bay Mockery. Uh, Macaw Mockery. <laughs> My English, not so good. Um, yeah, so that's not one of the uncommon foils that's a hit. There are a couple uncommon foils. Uh, the, uh, this one, the best one is Wilderness Reclamation. Well, where it's about 10 bucks. So that can easily help you get your 45 bucks back in this. Oh, our second mythic. Um, so this is a $5 Mythic. Like I said, uh, this Mythic up here, the Hydroid, is uh, actually the best. And then the rest of the Mythics are actually all under t um, 10 bucks. But a nice little $5 right there. So, 
we are over halfway to getting our mic back. And maybe, just maybe, our foil rare is worth a little something. Galloping Lizrog. And Hero Presic 1. We got a second one of those. Oh, about four packs left. We just need um, one good rare. Uh, or, of course, a good uh, foil. I don't know if we should expect... Why is this one not opening? I don't know if we should expect another foil rare or mythic out of 10... You know, we already got one out of 10 packs, so... Won't expect it, but it'd be, be interesting to see. Might be a free-for-all on a set like... Or a little bundle like this. Ooh, the breeding pool! There we go! $17 rare! Second most valuable card in this set, non-foil. <laughs> so, we got a $17 card, a $22 card, a $5 card. I think we're going to make our money out of this. And we get basically the free dice. And Nick, you out of the old ways. So that's the, uh, we've got a double tap on that one, basically. Um... Put that right there. So we got the foil and non-foil. I know the foil is not worth more than five dollars because I have a little cheat sheet where I printed off all the ones worth more than five. And I looked it over. And ooh, another mythic. Captive audience. So this one is a complete dud, it looks like. Captain Audience. So three Mythics. Two good ones. The best rare in a set. And here we have, into our last pack. So I, I think between everything, we got our value out of this. Um, especially got a little pack of you know foil lands and stuff like that. It might one day you know be worth a little something. See if we get a, I think we do have a foil in this set. Oh, another rare, Judith. Judith. And a rumble reading. All right. So for fun, we're going to go ahead and uh, open up this uh, War of the Spark as well. But I'm going to put up the prices just for the uh, uh, Ravnica Allegiance bundle pack. It's just a little something bonus for you here, so no commons really worth anything in this one. Um, so mythics and rares, um, and there's really not a whole lot of value to this set. Uh, the War of the Spark, not my favorite. We did get a rare the Sarkon. I don't even think that one's worth a couple bucks. In an island. All right, so that was a complete mess. I can see why we didn't have it uh, included in a uh, set. All right, so hope you enjoyed it. There's, there's our pool right there. I think we got our money back. So nice little bundle pack. Got a free die out of it. Got some free foil lands, basically. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Until next time, MTG Singles out.